to keep up, but I fall behind. Falling back, cause I dwell on the past in my mind. Hello guys, it is All9, and today we have a video on a glitching method that's going to let you breach through any wall. This is a very, very cool glitch. I'm going to show you guys two spots with this breaching method. All these spots are located in Forsaken. If this video gets 100 likes, then I'm going to be covering other spots on other maps, and there's going to be new spots in the video, so drop a like for that video. So in order to do this glitching method, you want to have PhD slider, and it needs to be tier 4. Now once you get that, you then want to change your button layout. You don't have to do this next step, but this will make this glitch a whole lot easier. And all you do for this is you want to go to settings, then go to accessibility, then go to button assignments, and put on this check mark that says enable custom button assignments, then go to custom button assignments, and when you're here, you guys want to go to the circle button and go right ahead and switch that to L2. If you do that, then this will make this glitch a whole lot easier. At this point, you want to back out and just make sure you save exactly what you have. So go to confirm and save it, and then just go right ahead, back out all the way to the game. At this point, when you press L2, it should make you slide. So you're going to be sliding with L2 instead of circle. Now at this point, all you do is you want to go to really any wall. This works in tons and tons of locations. I'm going to show you guys the best spots on Forsaken. Like I said earlier, if you want to see different maps and the best spots on Firebase Z, Dimachina, all that stuff like that, go right ahead, drop a like. If we get 100 likes, I will be doing that. But all you do for a spot is go right ahead, head all the way over to the teleporter. Then you guys want to run just like you see me. And just before you hit the wall, you want to slide, then pause quickly. Now, just stay in this pause screen for about a second or two, then unpause. If you have done it right and timed everything right, you should go right through the wall and you should be in this glitch. Now, this glitch is going to be tricky to do at first, but once you get it down, it's very, very easy to do. So, once you're in this spot, this spot is very good. All the zombies will pile up in front of you. You're going to be able to kill zombies, get easy headshots. You will be able to pick up all the items that drop if they're close enough. That means the pumpkins and all that. So it's very good. And this one is definitely one of the best spots on this map. And if you want to get out of this, all you do is simply just activate Ether Shroud, just like you see me, and you should be out of the glitch. Now this next spot is going to be on the other side of the map. It's going to be right above Quick Revive, and you basically do the same exact thing. So just head all the way over to this location. Then run just before you're about to hit the wall. You want to slide and then pause right after you slide. At this point, like I said, stay here for about a second or two, then unpause. And if you've done it right, then you should breach right through. That's exactly how you do that. Now, when you're in this spot, all you do to pile up the zombies is head all the way over here, get inside of this. Then all the zombies are going to pile up above you. You guys can melee them and shoot them. You will not be able to get headshots, but this is still a very good glitch for going through waves since nothing can kill you in this glitch. If you want to get out, simply activate Ether Shroud right here, and you will get out. Now that's it for this video. Those are the two spots. Those are my favorite spots with this wall breaching method. This breaching method is very good. You guys can breach through basically any wall, which is insane, and this really isn't too hard to do. But anyways, that's it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the pileups. Definitely stay tuned for more. And like I said, with these pileups, nothing can kill you. So that means you can go through infinite waves without having to worry about any zombies. But anyways, that's it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video, and let's get right into the comment of the day. So the last comment of the day is, Super Cali Fragilistic Expialidocious was the comment of the day for the last video. It looks like only one person did end up commenting at this time, so definitely looks like a lot of people probably just didn't know how to spell it. So shout out to WCL for commenting it and spelling it right. Good job to you. Thank you to everyone that participates with these comments of the days. So let's get right into the next comment of the day. So this next one is PhD Slider. Put that in the comments down below. And if you put that in the comments down below, then you will have a chance of being on the screen just like you saw WCL on screen. But anyways, that's it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Please like, comment, and subscribe to become part of the Ninja team today because I'm a Ninja. And be silent and I'm Coastal 9. But anyways, that's it. Peace out. See you in the next video. Have a great day. You guys are awesome. See you later. Peace.